Welcome beautiful people. It is the World YouTube channel. Today we will see about, I paid $10,000 to fly my dogs to New York on a private jet. If you like the video, hit the like button on this video. Subscribe the channel and comment down below. They're Irish jet setters. Guess every dog does really have their day. A UK woman had her pooches in dog heaven, or at least the next best thing after paying $10,000 to fly them on a private jet to New York, because it was apparently cheaper than the cargo hold. It was a great experience, once in a lifetime, Maddie Young, 31, told Jam Press of letting her canines join the Mile High Kennel Club, which reportedly included complimentary doggy treats and toys. This wasn't just another case of dog parents over-pampering their pooches. The pastor freelancer's husband, Stephen Whitworth, 32, who runs a tech startup, had reportedly landed a job in Brooklyn and the pair were trying to figure out how to fly their two pups, a two-year-old pug, Violet, and one-year-old Golden Retriever, Olive, out with them from London. Understandably, ticket options for this 3,470-mile-across-the-pond jaunt were not cheap. The airline quoted them around $15,000 for the two dogs to fly cargo. The quotes were crazily expensive, lamented Young. We were limited as airlines don't like to fly flat-faced breeds as they can be more prone to breathing issues. And while Violet didn't suffer from respiratory problems, the Londoner worried about stowing her pug below deck due to her advanced stage. Meanwhile, cruise liners had a two-year wait, ruling out traveling by sea. After scoring the interwebs for other options, Young came across, wait for it, a Facebook group dedicated to chartering private jets for dogs. It was full of people organizing flights and splitting the costs, the Brit exclaimed. The couple initially paid around $12,000, but the airline ended up giving them $2,000 for filling the plane. As this was the cheaper option by several thousand dollars, Young deemed it a no-brainer to let her dogs travel in style. In other words, it was ironically more economical to fly private instead of economy. Nonetheless, the Sunubi expat said she was nervous prior disembarking as she'd never flown private. Her fears were immediately alleviated upon arrival when crew members gifted her pups complimentary doggy bags before takeoff, apparently the canine equivalent of champagne and OJ. All of the dogs were given personalized toys and a bag of dog cookies, which was quite sweet, Yum gushed. Things only got better once they were homeward bound with the Brit, describing the flight as so smooth. There were eight dogs and ten humans, she fawned. All the dogs were super well-behaved. They mostly slept, chilled, and chewed bones. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe and turn on notification button for more videos.